Okay, so we have our map here uh, showing the lines and the points and the polygons for each layer we have. So now let's see how can we enable the snapping. When you are in the editing tab, you have the snapping option right here and you also have it on the bottom right here. If you click one time right here, you will enable the snapping and, and also you can enable or disable it from the top. So you have two places to enable or disable the snapping. So let's say for example, right now we are doing drawing for the freeway and let's see what snapping options we have by clicking on this menu here and we have the point snap to point is enabled and we have snap to the start or end point of a line feature and here we have the regular vertex snapping this is the edge snapping is not enabled and this is intersection snapping and this is midpoint snapping is not enabled and the tangent snapping is not enabled as well so here the ones that is highlighted with blue is the one that is enabled the one is not highlighted is the one that is disabled so let's check for example snapping to point you will see that when i choose to draw a line uh, once i come to the point you see the snapping here let me zoom in a little bit more and you see that when my mouse comes close to the snap to the point it snaps and it shows me that uh, what layer i'm snapping to and what kind of snapping it is and also here if we go to the polygon you will see that it will snap to the vertices and any vertices we have in any feature class it will snap to it also here because we draw this small polygon right here as a freehand it have a lot of vertices inside of it so whenever i'm on the edge it, you will see that it will snap in so many different places along the way but actually it's not this is not snapping to edge this is snapping to vertex but because it's a freehand it have a lot of vertices in it and here you have the snapping to end point or snapping to vertex any place on the line so that's how you can enable or disable snapping also while you are drawing you can right click anytime and enable or disable any type of snapping based on your drawing so sometimes when you're drawing suddenly you don't want to snap to an edge you want to snap to a vertex so you enable the snapping for the vertex and you disable it for the edge the next thing we have is how to set the snapping tolerance and as we know the snapping tolerance is how far is the mouse from the point that it will snap to so for example if i zoom into the point right here so now i can click on set snapping tolerance and you will see that my mouse is showing that the current snapping is 10 pixels so if I right click anywhere, I will see a circle is drawing and show me how many pixels my new uh, snapping tolerance will be. So let's for example make it 35, I will click. So now my snapping tolerance is 35. So when I come 35 pixels away from any point, it will snap to it. Before we do this change, it was 10 pixels, now it's 35 pixels. In order to return it back, you can use the same tool or you can go to snapping settings and it will show you what is your snapping tolerance and you can change it from here and you can change what unit is used to this tolerance you can use pixels or map units and here you can enable or disable the snapping for 3d if we have a local scene or a globe scene opened like in the map we can enable or disable the z snap and also you can change the z tolerance as well same for the xy tolerance here you can change the tip color so if we make it red right here and say OK, you will see that the color changed it to red. Uh, the last thing here we have is a snap to sketch and it's enabled. So what that does is like if you, for example, drawing a line right now and this is a vertex, you will see that when, when I am moving my mouse close to the vertex, it's snapped to it. If this one is disabled right here, if I come here and disable the snap to sketch and say OK, I'm not going to be able to snap to any vertex while I'm doing the sketch. So snap to sketch will allow you to snap to any vertex or edge or end point while you're doing your sketching. And that's it for snapping. How can you enable it? How can you change the settings? What is the difference between every snapping option? Uh, in the next video, we will draw all our features for the freeways, for the cities and for the counties. And we will see what other options in the editing we can use. So that's it for this video. And if you have any questions, please let me know and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks.